Hello and welcome back to another QGIS tutorial. In this tutorial, I will be importing coordinates to QGIS and convert it to shape file as well. Before proceeding to the tutorial, please hit and subscribe the channel for the latest tutorials and lectures in GIS. So now, let's proceed to the tutorial. First, make sure that you have text of the coordinates and bring them to Excel. Here, be careful on X and Y. The X always represents longitude and Y always represents latitude. Here I am importing station number as well as it can be helpful on distinguishing between the points and labeling the points. After your Excel file is ready, save the Excel file to CSV format. For this, click on File, go to Save Edge and find CSV, comma delimited. After that, find a location of your choice, give a name and save it. Now, open QGIS. So, to import the coordinate, go to Layer, Add Layer and select Add Delimited Text Layer. Select the file from here. Make sure that the file format is checked on CSV. On Geometry Definition, check on Point Coordinates. On X field, select Longitude and on Y field, select Latitude. On CRS, give the coordinate reference system of your data. You should always be careful on selecting the coordinate system edge. Incorrect CRS will lead the point to wrong location. You can find your CRS from here. For my case, this is my coordinate system. So let me select this one. You can see the sample data over here and this seems to be correct as well. So after this, click add. Here we can see the recently added coordinates. Now let's convert the coordinate data in save file. Saving the data in save file will help you to use the data in future um, by just importing the save file. For that, right click on the coordinate file, go to export and select save feature edge. After that, in file, select ESRI save file. Click here to set the location to save the file. After that, give a file name and save the file. Let's check out the attribute table of the recent save file. Here we can see station number, longitude and latitude as well. Now let me label the added point with a station number. For that, right click on the recent save file, go to properties and select label. Here in the value, select station. You can change font size from here and font color from here. For now, I will leave it to default. After that, click OK and here we can see the point with the station number. That's it friend, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like and share the video, subscribe the channel, your support means a lot for us. See you in another QGS tutorial, happy learning.